What is going on guys, Jay here back with another video. Today I'm just going to give you guys a little update on my beta. And for some reason, uh, the other night I noticed he was fin nipping himself. I don't know why he's doing that. Uh, it's pretty sad actually because his tail was literally like 99% healed up um, from when he had fin rot. So I, I don't know why he's doing that. I don't know if it's just because he doesn't like how long his tail was getting or what. I mean, it was getting really long. It was really pretty too. But as you can tell, I took the filter out. Um, I'm thinking about putting it back in, but the reason why I took it out is because I, I feel like maybe that was because uh, the reason why he's fin nipping himself was because of uh, the filter blowing him around too much and he was getting frustrated maybe, I don't know. But I turned the heater sideways since there's not as much uh, circulation in the water. Um, that way the heater can accurately heat the entire water column. But I turned it sideways, that way there's a greater surface area of um, heat dissipation. But other than that, uh, I moved these five ghost shrimp in here. I don't even think you'll be able to see them. Um, there's one right there. Uh, there's actually another one right here, uh, right there, and then right there on the Ma Marimo moss ball. But I took them out of my 10 gallon desk aquarium tank because I caught like three of them getting sucked up into the filter. I don't know why they were attracted to that filter so much, but they every time I pulled one out, they would just run right back to it and get sucked up in it again. So <laughs> I don't know what's up with them. They're like on a suicide mission or something. I don't know. But I pulled them out of there, put them in here because there's no filter. So uh, they're doing great. So anyways, that's an update on Redman. Uh, it's pretty sad to see him fin nipping himself like that because He's probably my favorite fish at the moment, just because he's he's got so much personality compared to all the other fish. I mean, he comes up to me and greets me every time I walk in the room, and he starts swimming back and forth, all happy and stuff. And he knows when he's gonna get fed, and he looks up at me when he's eating and stuff. It's he's a cute fish. But anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.